Welcome to WatchGuard Security Fight. I'm Corey Nockrander, and today's story is Google's Password Checker. Today's story is more a security tool tip than any sort of news story or video about breach. Today, I want to tell you about a new Google Chrome extension called Password Checker that just came out, and it's something I actually recommend you go out and get if you understand its implications. As you probably know from many episodes of this particular video, Password breaches, or more specifically, credential leaks, are very, very common lately. Most recently, collection one through five leaked to the dark web, and this is just gigabytes and gigabytes of, of leaks of email addresses with either hashed or clear text credentials. Bad guys can use this to often crack your password and log in as you on different web services, and if you're one of the few people that use the same password everywhere, which is a very bad thing, they might be able to emulate you on any web service at all. Anyway, Password Checker is a cool extension that will help guide you and tell you if you are ever logging on to a site with one of your passwords which has leaked to the public. Essentially what it does is as you're logging on to different sites, it, it takes a copy, a hashed copy, not the clear text password, but a special cryptographic copy of your password, and it submits it to Google, who has been aggregating all of these leaked passwords, like other people, including my threat team and people like the Have I Pin Pwn site. And then it compares the hash of your credential or your password to all the leaked credentials that have leaked on the dark web or on other sources over the past few years. And if you have a leaked password, you'll get a red box pop-up warning you that you better change your password on that site. So it's an excellent tool that really takes no work from you that will automatically tell you if you're using an insecure password on a site because it's been leaked. Now, I do recommend this tool. I've installed it myself and it works very well. I will say you do need to be aware of the privacy implications here, although it appears that Google has done a very good job designing this system in a secure way. Obviously, for them to compare your password to these leaked passwords, the browser, Chrome, and this extension have to see your password on these sites at some point. Now, the good news is Google doesn't actually take a copy of your clear text password. Google uses a number of hashing and cryptography methods to actually store that password in a non-clear text way. They also realize, even though they're sending this data to Google over an encrypted connection, there's a chance other people might be able to intercept it. So again, they're sending this, this kind of copy of your credential in a way that people can't really reverse it or reuse it. Uh, if you want to know more about this, I'll be sure to post a link to the blog post on Google's site in the R Cyclicity article associated with this video. In any case, it appears that the way Google is doing this is in a way that they never see your actual clear text password. They can just compare the hash of it to the list of leaked hashes as well. So they seem to be doing it securely, but some people don't trust big corporations. Google does use people's data. So really it's up to you whether or not you want to trust Google with this. But I do recommend the tool. It's very, very useful. So that's it for today's story. If you're interested to always know if any of your passwords at certain websites have been leaked, I highly recommend you use this extension called Password Checker. I'll be sure to put a link to the extension in our blog post associated with this video. That's it for today's story. Thank you for watching.